Right. Yeah, so it's like you have to do. It's like there, there aren't really easy answers for anything. It's like you go to the doctor and it's like, well, did it? Did like this hurt? So I go to the doctor. You go and like so then they give you something to like instantly make that specific thing feel better. But that's not really how it works because you don't really know like how many layers are involved with what's wrong. And you can't really like help yourself out until you just like give in to the fact that it's going to be a challenge to fix, which is hard because I mean, we've somehow been conditioned to believe that we can fix things instantly, especially like in this society. Um, but I just, I just don't think that's as realistic as we mm-hmm. like to pretend that it is. And it kind of can be easy. Like it's just like, yeah, you see it and it shifts, but it's from such like deeper level than taking a pill for it to go away. Right. How, how is there such a safety net? So that it's like there, there isn't a risk of like things going wrong. Or you know. How is it? Yeah. Because you're not doing it. Yeah. You know, when I'm tapping you on the head, I'm not actually doing anything to you. I'm just saying to your brain, you know, your body is saying, okay, this is what we need to look at. You know what I'm saying? Okay, brain, go and look at it. So, your body's not going to do anything that it doesn't want to do or it doesn't need to do. Because right. I'm not forcing anything to happen. I'm not doing anything. Yeah. I'm just getting your brain to take a look and see itself. Yeah. So, if I, you know, get a wrong answer and I tap you on your head, your brain's going to be like, yeah, 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 we know that already. Like there's nothing to see. Yeah. So it, and then like maybe you wouldn't feel anything. <coughs> right. Right. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Yeah. And it's amazing like how the different things kind of unveil themselves and go together. And, you know, that this thing needs to happen and then that thing and then that thing and then like yeah. you've got this picture and then this thing and that thing. And, like how the sessions kind of go together and unfold is just. Yeah. It's like I feel like it's me feeling like slightly nauseous almost for like for an hour. But I've felt like a little bit like mm-hmm. and then I feel like big time of like stuff in my legs. Honestly, I think I must I was thinking about this earlier today, I was like, my all of this muscle really be necessary to like facilitate movement. Like you know, it's just getting in the way. And I think it's such a common problem for dancers especially. Just to, it's like, I've done Pilates, and in doing so, you know, like, overdeveloped hamstrings. Like, how, how many people can, like, even does that happen to? 